Welcome to the channel guys, today we're going to be playing Julia. We struggled a little bit against Wally, with this took us like four goes. Lorenzo we breezed through, so let's see how we do against Julia. Let's see how my play style count, like, bounces off hers. So she plays the Dutch, which is an opening for white, isn't it? Oh, this looks really bad. So that allows that, which is almost mate, if this... Uh, if I take though, it's more of a threat, right? This the gambit doesn't look very good. So that stops that. <laughs> okay. So if I can dislodge this knight. Get the bishop out. And then pawn. And then maybe dislodge the knight. Wow, she's giving away a lot of material here. So if that... Let's do it. So yeah, she has got good development. So we should probably prepare to castle. What if we just get the queen out with check? Maybe they block. They still can't castle. I don't see why not. I'm happy to trade queens at this point. I'm up, I'm up two pawns here. Oh, come on. All right, we're doing it. We're up two pawns. Surely this is just winning. Uh, castle, there's no way they can really attack me. That I see. It's funny these bots, sometimes you just you just get an alright game and then sometimes it's the, just the hardest thing ever. It, you've got to spend a bit of time in the opening just blunting the effect of this bishop. Maybe here? I can go here looking to target that. Maybe a castle. You know what, this move looks good though as well. They can't castle and give me check at the same time. Quickly noting that. I'll, I want this move to stop this and this. And also, the bishop's never actually threatening the pawn in that case as well. And now if I'm able to take this knight and, and separate the pawn out from the, from the pack, then I'm, I'm sure this is winning. If I take, he takes, I take, then he takes here. Uh, so if that, I maybe get this. I'm not too fussed. We're so happy to take that, guys. I know it's bishop for knight, but look. The pawn structure, maybe this can be clarified and she can improve this structure by bringing the pawns together, but... This is always going to be weak. Ah, oh, look at this diagonal for my bishop. This is such a strong piece. Let's castle. Although they are going to have the open file. You know, if this, then this pawn is under threat. So maybe we look to castle in the other direction. If we go here, we get this. Maybe we would just play a bit slow. Do try and do that. Yeah, maybe castle long. I like this. Quickly checking this. Although, what about if bishop here pinning the knight to the king? Do we mind? Not really. The other knight protects. So if we push. And takes, takes. Is there anything there? I don't think so. Now, if they, do we take? We could take with a rook. Uh, any benefits taken with a king? Taken with a rook, we can better let it double up. So 
this move prepares this, trading off a piece. But then we would have doubled pawns at the end of it. I'm not quite sure about that, because a lot of our advantage is in the pawn structure right now. What about that? Just closing off the bishop. Mm, does it create any weaknesses? Not that I can see. That square looks really nice for our knight. Uh, maybe we just bring a rook to the open file. Seems like a good improving move. What if we push? Takes. We get here, they can maybe hit our knight. Uh, but then we get, like, check. Protected as well. Here, here, we end up with a worse pawn structure, so I think I prefer this. Okay. I guess they're threatening... They're not threatening mate, though, are they? They're just, isn't this just losing a pawn? Or even just that, pushing. But take the pawn. They can get the rook... They can't even do anything. I don't, I don't get it. I think they're just losing. We push. I almost like, I almost prefer pushing to taking because pushing, he has to stop us getting to this square because this bishop covers the diagonal. Whereas this diagonal also looks pretty good. Let's take the pawn. Let's just make sure we're up enough material to win. They both look good. Now we get that. And then we can lock it in with this. Get in the bishop. Preparing this. And this is just winning, right? Seems casual against Julia. Almost too easy. A bit like, I'm a bit suspicious that something's going to go wrong. We can just hit the rook now. Ah, but then, can they threaten mate somehow? No, I don't think so. We just hit the rook. Okay. <laughs> wow. And now, we want to go like this, but obviously bishop is here. So in that case, we... Maybe push the pawn and go like, I don't know, uh, bishop is well placed, so maybe we go like that and this and trade off the bishop, but then he'll take this. Right, we're up enough material though, so if we go here, and then here, take, 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 but then we just clean up. Uh, I don't really know how to get this. Rook out. Let's do this. Making sure there's no night forks or anything. So we wanted to play this move anyway. Uh. What about that? It looks good, but I'm not sure. I'd love to get this move in. We could sack a pawn. If they take, then we get this move. Uh... I'm taking a bit, a bit too much time here, guys, but I just want to make sure that I don't mess this up, so bear with me. Um, uh, let me know, guys, are you enjoying these bot videos? Because I had a few comments saying they prefer the non-bot videos, but then the bot videos get a lot more views, so I'm not really sure what to do. But yeah, give me some feedback, and I'll know where to tailor the content towards. Yeah, I feel a bit stuck right now. So he's going to take this. 
if we, this pawn's lost anyway, so here, here, then we get this move, right? So if here, how do they stop this? Uh, even just that here uh, maybe just king up one just to protect this pawn just guaranteeing the win one slower move I mean surely that's winning right Oh no, because then it's double attacking the pawn. <laughs> uh, so here, here, here. We get another defender. We're happy. And now... Don't we just get this? No, not quite. Because this takes. Uh, so like that threatens it, this, this idea. Hmm. All right, let's get out of this pin. Making sure we're not falling for a fork. Check. Here. Check. Takes. Uh. Anyway, I like progressing with check. Not working yet. Uh, do we push? Making sure there's no fox. If takes takes. We've also got to watch this watch this pawn a little bit. Uh, no fox. Careful now. Uh, Still no fox. Staying vigilant. And now our king is the most important thing, really. We need to... Oh my god, that bishop stops this. Wow. Do we go up? Uh, we go here though. Hmm. Normally you want to get up, but I see if we do this, we can make the king go that way, and then I think we're winning. Whereas if we go here, the king can. Hmm. I don't know. I, I like this for some reason. But then if here. We go here, king gets in. So maybe that? Not sure. So here, here. If here, king gets in. Hmm. If we go here. Then he can just push past, I guess. Oh my god, it's, this is winning. This is definitely winning. It's just a case of navigating it. Julia, ugh. Getting really tricky in the end game. Right, so takes, takes, takes is good. But if we go here, they go there. And then we've actually got big problems on our hands, stopping these pawns. So here, here, here. Here. And then we push this pawn. Uh, 
right? Uh, is there any tricks? I mean, she's going to have to come onto this diagonal. And when she does, we take the pawn with check. And then what about that, that, take the bishop? We don't need to promote the pawn. We can just do this, this, or just that. Uh, just quick check. Yeah. All right. Julia, we've beaten another 1800, guys. So there we go. Bishop off the board. Let's cut this king off. <laughs> Thank you for joining me on the journey to defeat all these bots, guys. I, can't, I still I can't quite believe that we're managing to defeat 1800s. When in in blitz game we games we keep uh, we keep struggling against like thirteen fourteen hundred sometimes. Just when when we take the time pressure off, it see we see uh, our full potential. You know, this is how you gotta you gotta get better at chess. I think slow down. Yeah, drop a subscribe, guys. I saw only only uh, like ten percent of you are subscribed, and I was. I was very heartbroken at that, so. <laughs> and thank you for playing, Julia. I'll see you next time.